What's up YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. And I got another hack for you guys today. And in this video, I'm gonna be teaching you guys how you can get a free auto clicker for any game on Roblox, any mobile game on any mobile device, Android, iOS, you guys are good. And I mean, yeah, it works for multiple games. It even has a little custom mod menu for certain games like Roblox, it has a little mod menu which I'm about to show you guys that in just a minute. So go ahead, hit the like button, drop a comment down below, hit the subscribe button, and do all that fun stuff for me if you do enjoy this video. So as you guys can see right here, we got Auto Clicker Pro installed. So we wanna go ahead and obviously open this up and just give it a second to load and it'll bring us to the settings page. and. I already have the auto clicker turned on, switched on. So what I'm gonna go ahead and do is just choose a game. I can click on any one of these games. I'm gonna click on Roblox. It brings me into Roblox with the auto clicker open. You don't need to open Roblox from the normal app. You gotta open it from here. And as you can see, it has a couple options. Record and play, record image and play, and then play down here. So you basically just click the record button, do what you gotta do, and then click play. So obviously, I mean, I don't have any you know games that I really wanna play right now and show you guys auto clicker with, but I will go ahead and show you, you know, the mod menu, all this stuff. It does work, obviously. So yeah, if you guys wanna go ahead and learn how to do this, then go ahead and stay tuned. You can do it on iPhone and Android and let's get straight into it. All right guys, so if you wanna go ahead and learn how to download this, just follow the steps as I'm about to do. If you're on Android, you can skip to the end of this video and you can just go to the website that I'm about to show you guys and you can just download it from there. But if you're on iPhone, you need to do a couple of setting changes first. So. The first thing you guys want to do is obviously go into your settings and scroll on down and go to your battery settings. Make sure that you guys got low power mode off. None of this other stuff matters. It doesn't matter. Just go ahead and make sure low power mode is switched off. You don't want it on. Even if you got low battery, it's better to have it off. So next up, let's go ahead and go into our general settings here and go to software update and not software update go to about and make sure that you guys have ios 12.0 or higher installed you got to have that installed or else it's not going to download for you as you can see i got 15.4.1 so i'm good on that i don't need to update anytime soon but if you guys are still on ios 11 make sure you upgrade to ios 12 because that's the minimum requirement you guys need here so just go to software update and update to the newest firmware if you guys have to. So next up, let's go ahead and go to the last setting you guys need to change, which is gonna be the background app refresh setting. None of this stuff down here matters. These are just all the apps that you have it enabled on. You guys want to go ahead and make sure that Wi-Fi and cellular data or Wi-Fi is turned on. You don't want to have this on the off setting because if you have it on the off setting, it's actually going to crash the app when you try and install it and it's not going to work properly. So make sure that you have it on Wi-Fi and cellular data or Wi-Fi. But keep in mind, if you have it on only Wi-Fi, that means you're going to need to be connected to Wi-Fi. So if you're not connected to Wi-Fi, so if you're not connected to Wi-Fi guys, Basically, just go ahead and make sure that Wi-Fi and cellular data mode is turned on. Next up, we're at the part where you Android users, all my Android friends can go ahead and start to participate. You wanna go ahead and go into your web browser, Safari, whatever, just go ahead, type in Safari, or whatever web browser you use if you're on Android, and go ahead and search for this app. You wanna search for Auto Clicker Pro right there all you got to type in is AU and it'll pop straight up and this is going to be on the website 
wetweak.co, W-E-T-W-E-A-K dot C-O. And you guys just wanna go ahead and hit the install button here. Just give it a minute to install. And we're almost there guys, because it's just gonna keep going. It's not gonna stop at all. So it only takes about 30 seconds to a minute, if not less. And once we get to the end, you wanna make sure that your phone doesn't go to sleep on you because if it goes to sleep or if it turns off, you're done and you gotta go ahead and restart the download. Now it's gonna give you the circle when it's done installing and it'll say this website is trying to download a configuration profile. Do you wanna allow this? You wanna go ahead and click allow profile downloaded. We wanna click close and then we want to go ahead and what I'm gonna do is go ahead and delete the version that I have downloaded right now and then go in your settings and go to general. Go on into VPN and device management. Click on auto clicker pro downloaded profile. Click install. Go ahead and type in your password. And then from here, click next, install. Install one more time done and boom just like that you guys got it downloaded so if you guys did enjoy this video drop a like comment subscribe and i thank you guys for watching peace out